I'm Eli the Electronics Guy, and today, let's talk about cutting the cord. So a lot of people ask me about getting rid of cable, um, trying to lower that monthly bill, trying to figure that all out. So my wife and I have now been, it's probably been 10 plus years now without cable. Uh, yes, we do have internet, um, cable internet, but um, we do not have any satellite, we don't have any cable service coming in. Um, so yeah, so I wanted to kind of talk about, uh, one of the devices that really helps us. We've got kind of a bunch of things. Um, but one of those devices is called a Tableau. And what a Tableau is, is it is an over the air DVR. So over the air, basically, if you remember the rabbit ears on your TV, so that still exists, that's still out and about. Um, it's just digital television. So you can get actually really high quality 1080p video. Uh, from an antenna. So where we live in uh, central Ohio, um, there's a good handful of channels, and I'll run through the system here in a second, and I'll show it to you. Um, but we have a decent amount of channels. Um, we have our NBC, ABC, CBS, Fox, uh, PBS, uh, that kind of stuff. Oh, and CW is another one. So what I've done is I've actually installed an antenna, uh, decent size, but smaller, out on the side of our house. Uh, and then I have the cable line running in here to the basement to the Tableau device. So you're probably at this point like, what is a Tableau device? So let me show you. Let me uh, switch my camera angle here, and uh, we can kind of go through the software and stuff. So let's go ahead and go like that. So this is what a Tableau looks like. So it's just a small little box, um, and then it has on the back side of that, it has a network connection port, and then a coax line that plugs into it. Uh, and then also you plug in a um, just a regular like USB hard drive into the back of this thing. And then what it does is it goes through. So I'm going to scroll down here and I do have the um, audio from this turned off. So like I could pull up a channel here, um, but I don't feel like getting any kind of copyright stri strikes from uh, YouTube. So this is just what it looks like here for us. Um, as you can see, I've got some subscriptions that I'm channels that I'm recording the the channel of. Um, so you'll see those kind of recording here. It just switched over to, yes, it is midnight. Um, but it's recording those right now. So you can see I have uh, NBC, and then we can scroll on down. I have ABC, Fox, CBS. Uh, that's our PBS. And then down into the CW. So there's a lot of these different channels out there, and there's a bunch of the then sub-channels that you can see. So there's quite a bit of content here. Um, and what this does is this device, the Tableau, is basically, think of it kind of like a time shifter. So it lets it go on, and it can record these shows. Like I said, it is midnight here, and it's recording some shows. And then I can go back and watch those whenever I want. So if I scroll down here to my recordings, you'll see these are all the shows that I have recorded um, on my system. So I'm a really big fan of like the Big Bang Theory. So I can come on here and then I can scroll down and it'll have my episodes of the Big Bang Theory that I've recorded. Um, I'm down here in my basement on the Roku, so it's kind of a, a slower connection, but up in the living room where I have the device hardwired, um, it just instantly pulls up pretty quickly. So how this works too is so the Tableau sits on your network. It's plugged into that hard drive and into the antenna. And then to be able to watch the shows, so what you're seeing here on my screen is this is actually from a Roku. So a Roku is, um, this is like the remote for the Roku. Um, it basically turns any TV into a smart TV. I'm a really big fan of the Roku devices. Um, there's the Amazon Fire Sticks, Apple TVs. Uh, there's a bunch of different stuff, and Tableau has the app for pretty much all of those. So I could go through, and technically I could watch any of these, but again, I don't want to get any copyright strikes from um, YouTube, so we're not going to play any of the content, but I could if I wanted to. Um, this one is like one of our local news channels I record, um, and then what I do is you can kind of see there where it says keep uh, last one. So what this does is this will only record the last episode. So it basically records nightly the 11 o'clock news. And if I don't watch it, I don't want the rest of it. So it just automatically purges those and then just records the first one. So it's kind of like a FIFO, first in, first out. And it's only recording one of those. And then everything else I just tell it to hold on to until I'm ready to delete. 
So those are my recordings. So uh, you can go in and look at like primetime stuff. So this is how you can schedule. So Tableau, here's the cool thing about Tableau is Tableau is, uh, there's no monthly subscriptions if you choose to not have the guide service. So you can buy the Tableau. It's a couple hundred bucks upfront cost and that's it. You don't have to pay for anything else. Um, the downside to that is you see all these little like um, icons pulling in of all the different TV shows. You wouldn't get that content. Um, you won't get access to the guide and that kind of stuff. So this populates out uh, for that guide service. So there is a fee of $5 a month for their guide is the last I remember. It might have updated recently. Um, so not bad though. Five bucks a month, you know, for TV and everything that you want to have. Um, for me, that was a sufficient, I was cool with that. But actually what I did is instead of having that monthly bill at the time that we got this, they did offer, it was $150, uh, but it was a lifetime subscription. So that's been about five years now, four or five years now. Um, I paid that 150 bucks and I never see a bill from Tableau ever again. So I'm into this about 300, $350 roughly. Um, but I never get a, a monthly bill ever again. So for some people, um, this is a service I do offer is, you know, coming out to your location, kind of giving you a rundown of how you could cut the cord. Um, so that's one of the services I do offer under Eli, the electronics guy, but so many people I see, like they'll have multi hundred dollar bills for satellite, for cable, for all this different stuff. And this is one of those devices that can really help you save a lot of money once you have, it is, there is an upfront cost, um, but it can really help. So, so you can see my subscription service here. Um, I'll have to uh, blank out some serial numbers there. Um, but this is my service. They do have a, an added premium service where it will like do scan, uh, channel skipping, that kind of stuff. Um, I don't subscribe to that. That just to me is not worth it. Um, and then I just have an old hard drive in there connected up. And then these are just some of the outside settings. So I can actually pull this up from anywhere on my cellular connection. So I can be out and about on my smartphone, on my Android or an Apple iDevice, iOS device. Um, and you can actually pull this up from there too and watch live TV. So right from your phone, it does use your cellular data, uh, but it is kind of cool that you can be outside of your house and pull all of your content up. There are movies. You'll see the movies on here. Um, depends on the channel, but sometimes they're good movies. Sometimes they're not. It really kind of depends. Um, so if I come in here to like all movies, um, you can look at like all the movies that I'll populate in. Um, personally, how I like to search movies is I come down here to the channel view. And then by going into the channel view, I can look at the individual channels. Um, and I know for an example, like the Fox um, is gonna be high res movies. So I can look at the Fox channel and that's the movie it's got. Um, let's see what any other channels, see if NBC has any movies. So if you know like your antenna, okay, so here you go, Secret Life of Pets. So this movie will play, let's see when this is scheduled to air. So this movie is scheduled to air on Sunday, January 23rd. So if I wanted to come in here and record this, so in three days is when this is gonna start, almost four days, um, I could come in here and I could tell it to record this airing. And it would actually go through and it would set up to record this for me um, when that scheduled recording is supposed to happen. Um, so it's a really cool device. I am really very happy with it. Um, to tell you the truth, this is actually my second Tableau. Um, my first Tableau um, ended up overheating. Um, it was one of the first generation ones. Uh, had some technical issues with it, but it was uh, three years old when we had it. Um, and then, like I said, this one's about four or five years old now. So, um, yeah, so I've, I've had two of these. Um they do make different versions. So this is the dual channel recording. Uh, I think for my area, that's been pretty sufficient. Every once in a while, I will have what they call scheduling conflicts uh, where uh, I'm just recording too much stuff um, simultaneously. So right now, how this works is it does have dual tuners. So it has two tuners built into it. So it can record two different channels 
um, simultaneously. So like right now, um, it's recording this Blue Bloods on channel 4.3, uh, and then also it's going to be recording Young Sheldon here. So right now, if I wanted to watch TV, I would have to watch one of those two channels. Um, I couldn't come in here and watch this Jimmy Kimmel Live. Um, it wouldn't allow me to do that because it those both of those recordings are or both of those um, tuners are taken up uh, by the shows that are recording. So I'd have to stop one of those recordings to be able to go into that. But for me, that's a minor limitation. I not a big deal. I work around that. So. Awesome. Well, hopefully this uh, helps you out. Um, again, I really like this. Uh, definitely, you know, cutting the cord is worthwhile. Um, you can save a ton of money. There's other services out there. You can look at like YouTube TV. You can look at like Hulu. Uh, there's other streaming services, but I, I really like this device because there's no monthly cost for me. Once, once I paid that upfront cost of setup, um, and then the, the one-time fee for the lifetime subscription for the guide service, I never have to deal with it ever again. So uh, if uh, this is a service you ever need help with, uh, feel free to reach out. Um, we can always do an on-site visit consult. I can come in and see what you have and give you kind of recommendations on uh, how you can maybe cut the cord. So feel free to reach out to me. I'm Eli the Electronics Guy. Have a good day.